Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kira and today I am giving you guys my monthly writing update of everything that is going on with my writing projects and if I've lost my mind yet because I haven't but I think that this last month got me pretty close. I was pretty pretty close. So first things first if you have never been to one of my writing update videos this is the second one I've done so it's not like they're really like a, a thing that I do a lot but I plan on doing them a lot. We're going to go over my goals for the month of June and whether I hit them or not and then we're going to go over my goals for the month of July and what I plan on trying to accomplish in that month. And we're gonna hope that we can do this before my camera dies. So here we go. Goal number one for the month of June was to hit 20k words in PD2, which is the second book to Project Dragon. I did not hit that. I didn't write any new words in Project Dragon 2. I I don't have enough plotted out for me to be able to write hit 20,000 words and then also proceed to write 30,000 words of the book in July like I plan on doing. So I just kind of scrapped that. I wasn't really too worried about it because my main goal was Project Werewolves, but we'll get to that. <laughs> so then goal number two was to start the second draft of Project Dragon 1, which is this book. I am officially in editing. This is the first book. It's supposed to be a trilogy. So I have the second book that I'm working on. There's a third book. And this is the first book. So I did start draft two of Project Dragon 2. I am fish officially in the middle of editing chapter four. So it's going pretty well. It's not going as fast as I would hoped it to but it also wasn't my top priority for June. <laughs> Again we'll get to what my top priority was for June <laughs> in a little bit <laughs> because <sighs> yeah so I did accomplish starting my second draft for Project Dragon. One I am about 16,000 words into my edit which isn't a lot of words if I compare it to being only on chapter four and I have 21 chapters. So I've already added a significant amount of words to the book. I would say that chapter chapter one and chapter two are both 3,000 words and chapter three is 4,000 words. So chapter four is at 2,000 words and I still have two whole scenes that I, well I still have a scene and a half that I need to finish writing and a scene that I need to finish rewriting before that one is considered complete. So it seems like I have a theme of how long my chapters are going to be, which I mean, I'm not too upset with. I usually write really short chapters. So it's kind of nice to be on the opposite end of having a longer, more thought out chapter. So next goal that I had for June was to finish my second draft, I guess you could call it, of Project Werewolves. I did not accomplish this goal. <laughs> I have given myself such a headache with this book that I don't know. I don't know what my plan is for it. My plan was to, well, this is what my plan was for it, was to finish the second draft of it. I replotted this book and this is me rewriting the first draft that I wrote with completely new plots. Characters are a completely different setting. Everybody's different ages. ages. The antagonist is a completely different person. Like everything is just completely different. So it's like a first draft kind of, but like also a second draft because it's still the same concept, just very much different. And then it just got really long. <laughs> I'm, it's two point of views. I'm almost done writing the point of view of the girl, but I still have a lot of the guy's point of view to write. And it's just become a big headache. The book is already like 63,000 words long and I don't even want to know how long it's going to be when I get done writing the guy's point of view. So we'll see if I work on it in the month of July. I think my main plan with it at this point is going to just be to set it aside so I can continue working on Project Dragon for now even though that wasn't really what I wanted to do but I just feel like I need to take a break from the book because I've literally been working on it for three months straight and my brain can't handle it anymore. I have never worked on a book <laughs> how many months in a row and not, I don't know, accomplished more than what I've accomplished. I mean, I've written 63,000 words, so I've accomplished something, but I don't know. So there's that. And then my last goal for June was to plot all of Project Dragon 2, which I also did not do. That was kind of more of a lofty goal that I just threw in there last minute to give myself more little goals in my goal box and my bullet journal. So yeah, I don't have all of Project Dragon 2 plotted out, which probably isn't the best since I plan on trying to write 30k of it in July, but I kind of have a vague idea of what I want to happen in parts of Act 2, so I guess it's going to be kind of like a discovery writer thing like with Project Werewolves where I write what I have and then plot out and then write what I have and then rearrange and rewrite and rearrange and rewrite and... <sighs> So that is my goal, how my goals went for June. Not the greatest. I also had some hiccups of the month. I family came into town, 
not a hiccup that I'm upset about. I love seeing my brother and everything. I very much enjoyed him coming to town. I also got a kitten, so I spent an entire week with this kitten that is now a terror and just I feel like he thinks that he just owns my entire house. Now for my July goals. I'm surprised my camera hasn't died yet. I'm probably gonna jinx myself. Knock on wood. On to my July goals. So goal number one in July is to complete NaNoWriMo. Can't NaNoWriMo. My goal is to write 30,000 words. 30,000 words is usually a very easy goal for me to hit so I'm hoping that this isn't gonna be too hard. I also think I'm gonna put in here for a monthly goal. My goal is to actually officially post a weekly vlog for every week of Camp Nano to update everybody because I like making them and I always peter off halfway through the month and I hate it so that is my goal. Please people hold me accountable for this. I will be posting weekly vlogs for the weeks of Camp Nano. I'm gonna write add that in my goals. Goal number two that I have is to write 30k and Project Dragon 2. I want to get a very rough draft of the second book done and then I also want to get a very rough draft of the third book done. So then I have them written and I kind of know what's happening so I can start foreshadowing things in the first book but then I also can start referencing things from the first book or making sure that like long plot lines are like woven in correctly. I got this idea from Kate Cavanaugh. She is trying to write all of the books in her Meridian Map series right now. She's fast drafting them. She's on like the third book, the third book <laughs> right now. And so I took inspiration from that. And then my last goal for July is to edit half of Project Dragon, which would mean to get to chapter 11 in my edits. I'm already on chapter four. If I, I, if I continue on the path that I'm on, I think I should be able to do more than that. But my goal is to at least get through half of my edits for Project Dragon so that I can finish it, the second draft by next month and then I can put it aside and focus on other things for a bit and then go back to it type of thing. So those are my goals for July. Not anything crazy. I'm not trying to go too intense with the writing goals just because it's Camp Nano because I also want to read some books because I haven't read like any books in the month of June which was really sad because I have a bunch of books that I want to read. I wrote here on my I have a sticky note here in my TBR section of my bullet journal. I have like five books that I want to read that like I've been wanting to read. I've just been like, you know what I could be doing? A better thing I could be using my time for? Writing my book. And so then I just <laughs> end up working ungodly hours on Project Dragon. Like I was up at like 2 and 30 in the morning last night in here just like staring at my Scrivener file and I wasn't even writing anything down. But for some reason staring at it was just as productive as not writing anything down. So there's that. Yeah those are my writing goals in how June went for me. Project Werewolves is still a giant clusterfuck and I feel like it's never not going to be a giant clusterfuck until I finish the draft. So hopefully that can be something that I accomplish in July as well. I'm not going to put it as a goal because I'm not going to I'm not going to try to force myself to work on that many things at once. But yeah, those are my writing goals. If you enjoy me giving you writing updates, please like this video. Comment down below if you're participating in NaNoWriMo, what books you're writing, just anything that you want about writing, books that you love that you think that I would like. I enjoy romance and fantasy for the most part, contemporary books. I'm also trying to get into like the thriller genre. So if you have any contemporary romance, fantasy, and or thriller books that you enjoy, please recommend them to me in the description box below. Not the description box. In the comment section below. And I will add them to my TBR on Goodreads because I'm trying to branch out, I guess. And so I'm going to slowly add a genre. So I'm adding thrillers for now because I know I like thrillers. I just don't read a lot of them. Anyways, and if you like writing updates and enjoy looking at my face, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on that notification bell because I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!